Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy Jason here coming at you one more again. A uh, problem I encountered uh, recently is I just stripped out uh, my brake reservoir, front brake reservoir screws. And I really didn't have a clue what's going on. I mean, how to get them out. Um, I looked on the internet and nobody really posted anything on how to get these out. So what I did was I went to Harbor Freight and as you can see I got a screw extractor set. Uh, this was only 10 bucks at Harbor Freight. Um, if you're working on dirt bikes or motorcycles you are going to counter this problem with your front brake or rear brake reservoir. Um, so I went to Harbor Freight, spent 10 bucks, got this uh, screw extractor, uh, Use this one right here and came up, chucked it in a drill and hit it in reverse, hit the drill in reverse and it screwed these screws on out. Even though they were stripped out, uh, the screw extractor works. That was 10 bucks well spent. Okay, from there I uh, took these screws down to uh, a local uh, bolt and nut shop and came back and this is the pack I got I got a hundred of these no I didn't need a hundred of them but they couldn't split boxes uh, this right here was uh, six dollars for this whole pack so if anybody's at the track and they stripped them out I got some and what I'm gonna do is put anti-seize around the screw before I screw the new one back in there. Um, this pack of screws here that I got, hard to do this with one hand. Uh, instead of Phillips head screwdriver, these here are hex head, Allen bolt or Allen screw. And what I'm going to do is put some anti-seize around there and put it back in my brake uh, reservoir. So that way next time uh, it won't be stuck. Um, I have talked to a couple guys and they said they had to take their uh, brake reservoir to a machine shop to get them out. Um, all it cost me all together was uh, I'll say $16 but this screw extractor I can use that on anything that that was a lifesaver and like I said Harbor Freight $10 but guys if you're working with dirt bikes or motorcycles you will encounter that problem anyway guys that's just my little tip y'all take it easy